Previously on Flashback. The Epicurean Enclave is located on one of the inner rings of Yellow District, not too far from uh, your old guild hall. Hey, okay. can, I, can I offer you something to eat, something to drink? I just made cookies. They're chocolate chip. Okay. Let Seekers me... of the Dark. Coffee is black. Oh my god! Hi, my name is Jacqueline. I am the the uh, guild master of the Seekers of the Dark. We are not a cult. We can we can get you a modest building. Um, I would say practice hall size. Yeah, so we can get you inner city red district, or we can get you a place with a yard on the outer rings. We, we're we're prepared to offer you a uh, five percent for. Uh... <laughs> I don't know which way you swing, but I can kiss you right now. <laughs> uh, I seduce the get no. I well, I mean, we are we are we are a business meeting, but call me later. Kadia. But we cannot ruin this for her. You will. I will never mess this up. Avalon said to meet you in the. Or actually, the council meeting. She right. never told us we're in a meter. Oops. <laughs> Okay, we Take should split up. To the sky. To yep. <laughs> gonna go to the sky. We should split up. I'm actually right. gonna walk over and to my friend. Where was the council? Up on the up on the the bluff. Cool. Bye. I, I, Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Where is our li- um, uh, friend with the broken leg? Where was she? Elson. Yeah. Uh, she's probably still at the. Excuse me. The caravan. Oh. Okay. You better go retrieve her and tell her we found the place. I'll go get her. You guys. You fly around. I'm going to start yep. walk. You and me. Let's start walking yep. towards the bluff, and yep. hopefully we'll run into Avenue. Hold on. Hold on. Here. Take Lucky with you. When okay. you find where we're supposed to go, send Lucky to find me. I'll be the big elk, and he can send me an image where we're supposed to go. Perfect. Or, I, I have a spell that makes a noise. Fair enough. <gasps> I can do Still, just to be safe. Be, be good for her, Lucky. Lucky uh, gives a little trill noise. And just kind of curls around your neck. Perfect. Are you ready to fly? <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> so I'm going to turn into an elk and just run towards All right. the caravan. Yeah. <laughs> Where are you going? We're walking towards the, the bluffs, right? The bluffs. Oh, right, right, right. You two are going together. Right. Okay. We're going to make our walk and hope we run into Aveline. If not, we'll at least get to the council and go, the rest of our guildies are in France. Take sense of panic. <laughs> okay. So from the skies, you are unable to find anyone Bluff. Let's do bluff first. I'll do okay. you last. Mm-hmm. Um, so you're heading towards the bluff. You don't see any sign of Aveline, but the 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 further you get into the city, the more close the buildings become, and you see less and less oh, alleys. Okay. Um, until you get to the end, uh, you actually have been this way before um, with Aveline, um, and you can see the elevator that leads up the cliff. Oh base. yeah, this is where we got our contract. You do sign. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's right. So you are now at the bluff, but no sign of Aveline. Well, fuck me. So what are you going to do? Are you going to wait here or continue the search? I wanted to meet all of us, so it'd be weird if only one of us showed up and was like, we didn't know what time. Um, I mean, you could go in and say, oh, we're waiting for the rest, and they'll be here shortly. What if you don't find her? <laughs> Any ideas? Mm. So yeah, it's just here at the bluff where we're supposed to meet. I mean, that's we, where the meeting's going to be. Okay. But we don't know if this is where Aveline wanted us to be. Where did she even go? I thought she was with us for some... No, she ran off to take care of something. Which, all right. <laughs> when we get to me, I do have a thing that I want to ask okay. about that. Hold time. Yeah. Um, should we just... Like, she's... We have a good view of the bluff. It's like a smaller bluff that only holds the building. No, or... it's a pretty big bluff. The 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 central bluff, the um the arcanic bluff, is a huge cliff face where where basically it's the center of the wagon wheel. Oh, um, okay. This, this should we look cliff. around the bluff itself and pray we run into her? That's with a shot. All right, let's, we're gonna search around the bluff. Okay. That's but wow. Oh wow. Um, what okay. I have to roll? Should I do my chart? Nah, it wasn't a okay. cast. 
Yeah. I'm trying to be better about there, that chart. Yeah, but we've only had it three times. I think you should do the chart. <laughs> three times? Is it perception that I'm rolling? Yeah. I got a 16. 16, okay. Um, I fell on my face. <laughs> <laughs> Daddy, help her up. <laughs> <laughs> okay, boss. <laughs> God, Daddy was there. Um, when you get to the top, you trip as you walk off the <gasps> elevator, <laughs> which is great, and Daddy does help you up. Um, you, however, spot a support uh, member. It's not Aveline. It's actually um, like a person in that vest and red pants, uh, just kind of running, and it looks like she's a messenger. But no, Abilene. I'm okay. busy on my face. <laughs> I'm gonna uh, get the attention of the messenger. Uh, excuse me. And uh, this person stops. And now that uh, she has stopped, you can see she is a half orc. Uh, and she gives you this bright smile, and like, "Hi, how can I help you?" Hi. Um, we're supposed to be meeting the council. Oh wow! Really? Yeah. Oh. We just got uh, the information that we we're supposed to meet them at the bluffs at noon, uh, at sometime in the afternoon. Oh. Okay. Uh, do you need like uh, what time or what? What, do you, um, what could I? What can I help you with? Well, one we're looking for a support. Um, a cat named Aveline. Oh, Aveline. Oh, uh, Aveline. Aveline. Have you Aveline. seen her lately? No, no, no. Okay. She doesn't come up to the bluff. I think she okay. works with the guild now. Yeah, we're that a... Oh, okay. The, yeah, we're the guild, the the conglomerate of misfits. Oh, 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 oh! You're the three o'clock. Okay. Three o'clock. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we have two hours. Okay. Yeah. Um, if you guys want to wait here, I can go try and find Aveline. I'm pretty fast. Can you find the rest of our guildies, too? Uh, if you can give me a description, she pulls out a, a, like, a notepad. <laughs> oh my gosh, you're amazing. Page. She's like, what can, I, what, can I, what can I get for you? A burb. A burb. Okay. Yeah, uh, a hair-cocra. Okay. Crow hair Ooh, uh, a crow. Yeah. Fancy. <laughs> <laughs> and we have a dark felon. Okay. He's very self- he'll, he'll announce himself, don't worry. Okay. And then we also have, uh, we also have a human who has both her legs broken. Oh. Yeah. And she might be with an elk. That is the... That's yeah, our dark felon. He's a druid. Oh, okay. So look for deer. Okay, cool. Uh, okay, I can do that. Cool. Um, well, just uh, hang out here then. Okay. Uh, let's see. Do you see. want some help? Uh, I, I do you? charge by the mile. Is that okay? Oh my. Oh. I'm a messenger. Yeah, no, yeah. no. Uh, how much is it per mile? 75 copper a mile. Oh, fine. Yeah. Okay, cool. Just, pay- I got the bill. <laughs> I, just, I just have to make sure that you guys are cool with it. Okay. No, help out, please. <laughs> All right. And she uh, jumps on the elevator and she gives you this like really lazy salute as it starts to sink. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's died. <laughs> well, you won't have to pay her then. <clears throat> so, uh, okay, you had a question. Yes. So, since I rolled so badly. Uh-huh. Um, could I recall the time when I saw Evelyn on the roof heading off and try to go into the direction that I noticed her going in? Ah, that's a thought. Uh, yes, you can recall that. She, from that building, was heading towards Green District. Yeah. All right, gonna go to your good zid there. Okay, so you're heading to Green District. We'll check in with you in a minute. Mm-hmm. Uh, you two are going together, right? No. No, you went with, with yeah. Senpai, right? Uh, okay, so you're heading back to the Guild Hall, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, I when you get there, uh, Alessandra is sitting outside uh, with Abilene. Mm-hmm. And they're just having a conversation. Just, you know, chatting. Um, and Aveline sees you coming. And it's like, oh, good, you're back. Did you did you find... Okay, good. Yeah, <laughs> that that is... was a nod, by the way. Where... Yeah, he nodded. I, um, I realized I realized after the last time he couldn't understand me. Yeah. So. Uh, where? That was a bad question. <laughs> Never mind. Um, <laughs> okay. I tried to, tried to draw the city with my... Uh, don't, don't, don't. Oh, my goodness. That is just... That's just awful. That's... <laughs> Go back to art school. <laughs> <laughs> don't make that face at me. You don't even have a lucky to translate for you. <laughs> oh, fight me. I will. I have claws. I'm small, but I have claws. Just like, and Alessandra's like, please, stop, stop. stop. Uh, I'm guessing since you're a deer, you're going to take us. Okay, cool. Uh, Help. Yeah, I get down. I I crop. I do like the horse sit down. All right, Alessandra like struggles uh, a bit, um, and it's clear she's uncomfortable. She she grunts in pain a few times trying to get on because both her legs are broken. Mm-hmm. Um, she doesn't even like saddle it properly. She just kind of flops. Actually, it. I think it was just one. Where are you, I'm Danny? I'm gonna say it was one because that doesn't make sense if she's walking. Danny, yeah. help her out. <laughs> okay, boss. No. Danny's not. Who are you, boss? <laughs> <laughs> um. So. 
Uh, she finally gets onto your back, mm -hmm. and um, Aveline decides to make herself comfortable on your head. You can't do anything. <laughs> ah, never mind, you can't. She digs her claws in. <laughs> to narrate, uh, Agreed Shamu disagree. shook his head. Yeah, you're gonna have to narrate that, bro. <laughs> Shamu reluctantly agrees to disagree. Uh, because Aveline cannot speak to you. She just kind of looks at your face and, and shrugs. And, however, and since I don't up. want, however, since Shamu is wise in the ways of accidentally bucking people off, instead of rearing up before he goes, he decides to do the motion with his head. Elknoid, <laughs> and then takes off running. Aveline is kind of confused. Like, what the hell is wrong with this druid? Aveline is is just along for the ride. Or uh, excuse me, Alessandra is just along for the ride. So, we're missing... um, yeah. me trying to follow the. Right, you're yeah. going to Green District. Yeah. Good. Yeah. Don't pick up anyone's phone number while you're there. Green Dis District, this is probably the first time you've actually been to Green District proper, um, is very, very nice. Hmm. It's a high-end part of town, um, and there there are several guilds, um, but not a lot of people on the streets, and certainly not a cat. Hmm. Interesting. So, like, the path led to Green District mm -hmm. that she was heading. Do I know anything beyond that? Uh, beyond that, no. He didn't follow her or anything, so she just, like, went off. Hmm. What is in the immediate area, actually? Um, behind the your guild hall. In, so, just behind the building, um, there is actually a toy store uh, called the uh, White, White Joker's Toy Store. Um... There is an inn just a little bit down the road called the Guard House. Wait, is that Red District? Yeah, that is Red District. Excuse me. It's actually the uh, Sleeping Snake. Mm. Snake. <laughs> Snake. Snake. Um, Sleeping no rope. Other than that, there's not really much of interest. There's a couple of businesses, a couple of homes, but nothing really of interest. She's in the Green District. Yeah. <laughs> Weird. Yeah. So wherever she went, Probably didn't stop in Green District. Alright. I will fly back then, but I'm super curious now that I know that <laughs> she had headed towards Green District. Alright, so, when you head back, you can actually see the elk pat, uh, patting along. Elk! Oh! I fly up. I'm like, oh! I found you guys! <laughs> hey! Hi! I'm so proud of you guys. You came back in time for the meeting. We kind of panicked because we didn't know <clears throat> where it was or where we were going. <laughs> Why did you shake? I actually thought you were, like, in Green District for some reason. Why would I be in Green District? I could have sworn I saw you heading over there one time. Really? Yeah. Huh. That's interesting. Can I, can I ride with you, by the way? He keeps shaking his head. <gasps> you ready to fly, chickadee? <laughs> Not really, but... Here we go! Oh my gosh! <laughs> <clears throat> Shamu thinks patiently to himself, flying. Ugh, I don't want to do that. <laughs> One day. Okay. All right, so you guys make it to, or you're, you guys are heading down the street, and oh, you get... I just realized I could have done an insight when she said that, like, when she was talking about it to see if I could <laughs> curse you for not reminding me. <laughs> <laughs> At this point, you know as much about this game as I do. Okay, so cool. <laughs> yeah. So I'm not going to help you. Right. You guys may be. Ow. Um, anyway, you're walking along, the, or you're, you're running along the road, and a uh, half-orc sees you, stares down at her, her notepad and looks up at you and says, Hey, wait! <laughs> well, that's a horse noise. That's I can't a horse noise. <laughs> <laughs> that works. Hey, uh, are you guys the, uh, the misfit people? Yeah! <laughs> All right, cool. Um... Hi, I'm Anara. Hi, Anara. Um, hi. I was sent to come get you oh. by your friends, the the Drow and the the the. Oh, up at the Fear bluff. Oak. Yeah. Oh, perfect. Okay, thank you for letting us know. We'll head back there right now. Okay, I'm going with you. I need to get my fee. <gasps> Sounds good. So she she passes along with you, and it's like, so why are you guys going to the council? We don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh. I. I Okay. Do you have I will idea? prepare your funeral now. Well, I mean, it's usual. If, if they don't tell you why, it's either really good or really bad. So, uh, well, hey, 50 50. I mean, what does really bad mean? Uh, well, it could be getting ejected from a uh, corial. Uh, it could mean uh, jail time. Um, I'm no stranger to this. <laughs> yeah, well, you're not here. 
But it could be really good. What's the really good? Well, you could be getting an award, or you could be getting, uh, like, may- maybe you got invited to the bluff. I mean, usually guilds don't go up there that early, but who knows? Maybe you did really good on your last adventure, and you just get to go up there and get first pick. <laughs> I just realized we never actually explained what happened to the corpse of the dragon. Oh, yeah, that was good. No, we gave it to a- Aveline last session. Oh, yeah, she probably sold it. Oh, okay. Yeah, sold it for parts, and, and, oh, yeah, you wanted researchers to take a look at it. Yeah, that's what we did. Right, I'll get you the results after this. Okay. Okay, so. Okay, so you guys make it up to the bluff, um, and Anara leads you to where you two are sitting. Says, okay, 75 copper, please. They were really close. I feel embarrassed. Here, I give her a gold. Keep the J. Oh, my gosh. Thank you. You're welcome. Can can I escort you to, like, the, the... That Ow. sounds badass. <laughs> I transform out she's... of elk form. <laughs> Which means she says yes. All right, great. Um, This way. Oh, thank you so much. And so Anara leads you um, to the center of the bluff. The bluff is um, <coughs> built in such a way that there is one large tower in the middle surrounded by eight other towers. And most of these towers have, like, high walls, so you can't actually see what's going on. Um, but you notice that the bluff is empty. We're like, so there's dead. no people. We're gonna die! Wait a what's minute. What's going on what? here? Ah! <laughs> Holy crap! Oh, beautiful. Oh, this is normal for the new year. Oh, oh okay. okay. Yeah, d- um, so, are you guys new? Yeah, yeah. yeah. brand like, new! Oh, okay! Oh, did you give Joe Abilene the contract? Um, you have the call. Oh, yeah, I'm down here. <laughs> uh, Aveline looks at it and is like, oh, later, later. Oh, sorry. Um, Anara is like, oh, okay. Um, okay, so how it works here in Yokorial is all of the guilds um, are competing throughout the year to get a guild hall up here. Uh, the reason why is because you get first pick of all the jobs. No. Um, you get free food and lodging. Oh, hell yeah. And you also, um, if you stay on the bluff at the end of the year, if you're here at the end of the year, uh, you get a pick from the the Hammer of Mishir's vaults. It's Oh. Do you know what what they are? They they're the they're the craftsmen. They they're like constantly jumping back and forth from the, the earth plane. Uh, oh. but they like make the best magic items in the whole world. And wow. like, if you Ooh. if you're here at the end of the year, you get to pick something from their vault. Ooh! And like having one of those here. gives you huge prestige. Like, people want to be part of your guild if you have one of these things. Shit, we didn't get one. Yeah, it's yeah. really good. So, so it's something to look forward to. Usually, the I first guild one for Jacqueline. <laughs> <laughs> Usually, the first guilds up here are, happen around midsummer, around Mirror Week. So you can check back then. Ah, oh, cool. Anyway, she mm-hmm. leads you to this um, this center, and I accidentally slipped into Jacqueline's voice halfway through that. It's okay. <laughs> um, she leads you <clears throat> to the center uh, tower, which is this massive red building, and uh, she she opens the door and, and offers you in. It's, Just take the stairs and walk all the way up, and you'll be there. Okay. Thank you. Uh-huh. How easy is that to fly? Oh, easy. Fly. <laughs> Off you go. So in this in this uh, tower, there is like a a, sen- a tower inside the tower that's just filled with a spiral staircase that goes all the way up. And um, as you walk up these stairs, it takes you to different floors. So very round rooms. Um, however, these stairs are actually magical. As you start to walk up them, they just take you to where you're supposed to escalator! go. Escalator! <laughs> kind of escalator, <laughs> but it's just... Oh, Shut no, no! Well, it's it's not movement. Oh, you just kind of appear there. It's like they squish down everything that you don't need, so you just walk up the stairs you need. Oh, oh. so it's like the it's a it's on the top floor. All the other floors are gone. Technically. Yeah, you like, just like walk and there you are. Well, then if Maeve's flying, she's just like, oh! <laughs> <laughs> we walked up. Did you smack well, into the ahead of you, Maeve? Honestly, did you smack you into the your, ceiling? <laughs> yeah, if you beat your wings hard enough, you might have bumped the ceiling. Uh, so why don't you make a dexterity saving throw? Yay! Okay, that is a 19. Okay, you're fine. Woo! 
So you're able to stop yourself before you slam into the uh, the glass ceiling. <laughs> <laughs> Beautiful. And you find so yourself... So where do the other floors go when that gets squashed? That's a good question. Too bad there's no one here to ask. You're actually alone at okay. the top of this very large tower. Weird. Well, uh, I guess... Is there, like, a door to knock on or something? Uh, you are in a room. There, There is, doesn't seem to be a door. Um, there is... A, couple, a dozen or so chairs. That's the only furniture in here. That, that's it. Let's go sit on the front row. All right. Is everyone going to go sit down? Yep. I'm going to go. Mm. All right. So you sit down. Um, all one, two, three, four, six of you. Right. Yeah. Um, and you just kind of awkwardly wait. Yes. And a couple minutes pass. I could really go for some of Jack Lewis coffee right now. <laughs> Anyone know any good games? Um... Oh, I know. Well, it's not a game. It's a song. I spy with oh, my little no. eye something beginning with B. It's you. It was B? Mm-hmm. Is I, that like a play I, 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 I thought um, you said me, and I was like, <laughs> yes, that's what oh, I Oh, I could do something beginning with me. Um, is it black? Mm. Sorry, could you give us a description of what's around us again? Sure. You're in a mostly empty room with a, uh, a sprawling glass ceiling. It's made of, entirely of red glass, mm-hmm. which gives kind of a, an eerie light to everything. Mm-hmm. Um, you are standing on plush carpet uh, that's dark and very, very soft, mm-hmm. um, as well as the dozen or so chairs that are made of cherry wood. Mm-hmm. That's it. Okay. No. Um, I'm going <laughs> to... I'm going to cast Dancing Lights and make my little man. <laughs> okay. Behold Just to man. entertain myself. Oh, I thought we were going to have a rave. <laughs> <Wait a minute. laughs> actually, no. I can't actually. Fairy fire. Oh. Everyone will receive a... I don't have to roll for this, but I want to. Okay. A green outline... Okay. And then I will also have this fire. <laughs> All right. You uh, you have a rave without the music now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And there goes the pants. Let uh. it sparkle. Oh, my God. I <laughs> regret everything. <laughs> um, oh, crap. Very fire is a first level spell. Oh. You just uh. wasted a spell. No, no. I, this one's a free action for me. Yeah. Well, but you wasted a spell slot. Oh, that means you got to roll. Oh, no, oh. it's a it's, it's, uh, uh, draw ability. Yeah. Oh, okay. Seriously, they'll roll. Yeah. Please don't fumble. Three. No. Okay. okay. Barely. Barely. <laughs> You're free for now. <laughs> As you guys are preparing to rave it up, mm-hmm. someone finally comes in. Oh. <laughs> I try to sit down as fast as I can as if nothing had happened. <laughs> um. This man that came in is an elf. What? Pushing that fire out. <laughs> and he's. A pleasure to meet you, good sir. Hi. Uh, I'm going to just kind of shimmy sham my hat a little lower. Just like, no. He has a sheaf of paper in his hand and he like looks at the papers and then looks at the four of you and it's like, uh. And flips through a few. Oh, you're the three o'clock. Are we the too early? early? No, no, you're fine. Oh, uh, okay. Sh- 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 okay, well, um. Okay. Okay. He kind of scoots a little closer to the door and it's like, okay. Uh, the, the rest of the council is somewhere. I don't care. Um, <laughs> Bless this man. Your guild has been picked to save the world. Have fun, and he turns to walk out. Wait! Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? And as, I, I want you to try that again. One more time. I need to, and one more time. As he's, like, starting to walk out, uh, two more people appear in this, um, in the doorway. And they, they look at him, and it's like, Jaffe, Jaffe, what are you doing? And the the elf is like, oh, come on, it was funny. One more time, Jeffy! <laughs> One more time! And they kind of nudge him in, and um, in, into the room walks a uh, Vakotian uh, with uh, darker scales mm-hmm. and a blue robe, um, and a uh, human gentleman named Athelion. Or, whoops, you don't know his name. Damn! We'll get better. We don't know. Do you, do you want to run that bias again? One more what time. Are do, what are we doing here? Uh, they they both look at Jaffe and they're just like, I need to go. This more time, time Jaffe. Okay. This is a joke, right? <laughs> yes, 
Yeah. Don't mind Jaffe. He's an <laughs> asshole. <Yeah. laughs> Jaffe's just like cracking up. Go ahead. I crack both my knuckles. <laughs> Give me a reason not to smite thee. We run the city. Sounds good. Yeah. I meant him, not you. You two are fine. No, we work with him. Uh, Jaffe just kind of chuckles and leans against the doorway uh, as uh, this this Bokotian and this this gentleman walk over to you and say, I'm so sorry. Um, <laughs> we don't want him to scare you like that. Um, you know, I normally happen to like elves. Um, congratulations. Just, just ignore him. Okay. That's what we do. Uh, the Bokotian speaks up. My name is uh, Elder Chalavas. I am, uh, I am the... Shoot. It's a pleasure to meet you, Kawapas. He's in charge of something. I'm too lazy to look it up. Yeah. Uh, and this is this is my associate, uh, Lord uh, Aphelion. Sir Jerome Aphelion. Nice to meet you, Sir Aveline. That works, too. Um, <laughs> we, we've brought you here because um, the of the dragon job. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Right. We did pretty good. Right, right. You the, did pretty good. This one, right? You get money to your bicep? The, no, I've got the bands on my arm that I've got. Oh, uh, right, right, right. Okay. Yeah, that one. Um, we, uh, we, we've we been keeping an eye on you. That hasn't taken you very long, has it? And uh, Jerome, I hope you weren't watching wait. this morning. Shush. Jerome chimes in and is like, don't worry, it's nothing bad. Um, we, uh, we'd like to make a proposition uh, to you six. Um, Let him went Danny. He'll be gone by tomorrow. Okay. Uh, but boss. Okay. <laughs> Seven. Six and a half. Whatever. We don't even know. Uh, uh, because of your excellent work for Saltius Pass, you've been chosen to be one of the possible groups to go save the world. What? Oh. <laughs> dear, dear. And dear, uh, darling, darling. Um... You've been watching us, right? Yes. And you know you... what I am, right? Yes. And your eyes are still fully functional. Yes. And you do realize it was only funny the first time when Jaffe did it, right? <laughs> this isn't a joke. Have, excuse, um, uh, have you been, you know, using the dream grass lately? No. Wait, okay, hold the phone. I think we're missing the big picture here. Save the world from What? Um, that is a good point, actually, but I'm more concerned. To explain. I'm more concerned they want me to actually start saving it. You see, I, we can't actually give any. Uh, excuse me. Um, Tuavis chimes in. We can't actually give any details. Well, that's shady as fuck. Shamu. Well, we only want to give the details to the group that wins. That makes sense. Okay. Because wins this is what? extremely. What? Wins what? Well, if you guys would let me talk. Okay. We're not We're participating sorry. in any We're filled with questions. Mon- I know, me. and I will answer them. But I'm not interested in participating in any of the Munchie games. Thank you very much. What? You know that popular book series, The Munchie Games? Oh my god. Oh my I'm god. Going to punch you. <laughs> Jaffe over in the corner is like, I get it! <laughs> <laughs> uh, but Chihuahua is uh, not right, amused now we got at two all. of them. <laughs> <laughs> um, basically, uh, you just need to keep doing what you're doing. Uh, we're having a competition with uh, any of the guilds that we think. Uh, will be a good fit for this job. Uh, understand that the succeeding in this not only saves the world, but it also earns you a permanent place uh, here on the bluff. Oh. oh. Yeah, this is a pretty big deal. So, you know, please take it seriously. We've chosen a few guilds to do this, and we're just we... going to be keeping an eye on you until Mirror Week. Do we get to know who the other guilds are? Uh, no, and actually, that's but... another thing. We don't want you to tell any other guilds. Because this is extremely, like, this is this high-end stuff, and we don't want guilds to get jealous that they didn't get picked. Right, right, right. And we don't want anyone to go try and do something stupid like the Golden Dragon Caravan a couple weeks ago. Wait, wait. That was them learning about this? No, no, no. We just don't, we don't want anyone to do anything reckless. I I, 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 I feel the need to point out that maybe you shouldn't say anything negative about them. Point to the Grieving Widow. Mm -hmm. Ah. My apologies. Uh, you you owe you owe a dollar to the bad typing jar. Like we have a dollar. What? What is a dollar? 
I should have said a silver, but whatever. How <laughs> dare you? <laughs> a dollar is a you're swear word in this down, world. You're breaking down my fourth wall, and I'm trying to keep this voice, and it keeps going over to Jacqueline. I love you, Jacqueline. Jacqueline's voice is so fun. I love her. It's so easy. Fine. You owe a peanut to the lucky. Oh, by the way, here. Oh, <laughs> I missed you, lucky. <laughs> I'm ignoring you from now on. Good idea. Yeah, good um, so, uh... <clears throat> So we just wanted to offer this invitation to to, to participate. And uh, Jerome jumps in. It's, like, it's it's not compulsory, but we think you guys would be a a, a very good uh, a very good fit for uh, what's coming. After one thing. Well, yes. That's, we're pretty good. Guys. We run this city. We're pretty good judges of people. We're pretty is, cool guys. And is there anything else that you can tell us about saving the world? Um. Yes, uh, you will have one year from the new year, so, you know. Oh, uh, so we minus a couple. Yeah. Oh, okay. And considering we'll be picking in summer, yeah. Well, why we are you waiting this long? <laughs> well, because we only get one shot, so, you know, we, we gotta make sure we got the right people. Well, why did it you needs a little less time for you guys, but we gotta make sure it's right. Okay. <clears throat> I'm gonna, I have, I have oh, yes. yeah. I'm gonna say to them, like, we understand, we will do our best, and oh. we have to be the perfect fit, good, but since the world is apparently at stake, please, yeah. I hope that you pick the right people for this job, because it's kind of important. It's probably not us. I, I assure you, we're keeping an eye on several groups. We, yeah. we will make the right decision, I promise. I okay, well, uh, meeting adjourned. Uh, yes, yes, um... Once again, secrecy. 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 Um, and you just keep doing what you're doing. You know, go on jobs and, and, and prove yourselves to be the best of the best. And mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Um, I've got paperwork, so get out. Thank, um, thanks for I'm sorry. That, that was rude. Uh, please, get out. I thought that would happen. Thanks for visiting us. For letting us visit you. <laughs> uh, and, they, and they just kind of stand there and, and wait for you to leave. Oh, okay, so we gotta leave. <laughs> I pick up our poor, broken-legged woman. I'm out of transformations for the day, so I'm gonna have to carry you all. Carry I you appreciate it style. anyway. Um, just, just, Do you need just... some help? Danny can help you. I got a boy. Do not <laughs> keep the satyr away from the woman of good class. I still got her, boss. <laughs> What do I do, boss? Well, I'll find something for you. Just uh, like, jump okay, on, boss. Jump off that cliff. I heard first, not, my boss. Your, your, first, your first job is just ignore everything that he says. Okay, boss. You should send him some coffee from Jacqueline. <laughs> As we leave, I don't know about the rest of you, but I could use a drink. But while we leave, oh. Mavis just gonna kind of like look back at them, like why, and then leave. <laughs> Specifically looking at the elf <laughs> and then leaving. So we're gonna go ahead and let a little uh, a little time pass here. Oh, okay. um, you're able to get to your guild hall, which is up in Blue District on Whee! the riverbank. It's very nice, it has a water wheel, which means you are one of the few guilds with power. <gasps> um and that night over dinner, uh Abilene, uh clears her throat and announces and says, I, I have a I have an announcement. Oh, okay. more of this! Yeah, uh, I have found our next adventure, our oh. next job. Oh, oh thank you. Does it, does it doesn't mess we... with our other. Does it mess with the don't um because of darkness? No, no. Okay, I, no, I, I, I checked. No, we we're checking. We do yeah. jobs here, not adventures. Okay, guys, whatever you want to call it. Your player, and you shut up. I don't give a hell. <laughs> <laughs> um, so we'll be leaving in in three days. Um. It's it's that candy job. Oh, the chocolate one. Yeah. So so we're never gonna do the kill the griblins job, are we? Well, we could do that in between. Uh, yeah, somewhere in there. Yeah. Um, right. um this, this one is is pretty high end, so um, it should gather some good attention. Okay. Yeah, that's kind of what we need right now. Uh, you yeah. know, I think I can do a plenty good job of gathering attention. So but we need the right kind of attention, boy. <laughs> Excuse me, but everything Damn. about me is right and in its proper place. So, uh, tomorrow, um, you want to spend your time, you know, getting getting your gear together, and uh, we'll be leaving in two days' time. Excellent. Sounds good. All right. All right. Uh, 
I'm gonna go out for a bit. Uh, you guys have a good night. Where? Hey, you better right. touch your dinner. Yeah, I'm not really hungry. Girl, That's you a... need to keep your health. Oh, okay. I'll, I'll be back. But where All are you right. going? Out. I want Maeve to follow her because she's seen her leave before, but I don't know. Okay, can you do can that. do that. I want to try. All right. Um. So what we're going to be doing. Uh, we're going to be doing something called a skills challenge. And this is going to be the first time we've done this. Um, they didn't have skills challenges in 3.5, but they did have them in 4. Um, what a skills challenge is, is you have to get, you're going to use your skills um, to try and track Abilene. Okay. Um, and if you fail three checks, uh, you lose her. But if you succeed a certain number that I'm going to keep hidden, that's a lie. Uh, you have to succeed four times. Right. If you succeed four times, you'll be able to follow her to her destination. Okay. So, um, how this works, though, is you pick your skills, and you just need to explain how that skill is going to help you keep track of Adeline. Okay. All right? So, she walks out the door, um, and after uh, a few, about half a minute, 30 seconds or so, uh, you leave as well, and you see her walking down the street towards the uh, center of the city. Okay, so are there buildings around? There are, yes. Okay, so first off, um, I'm going to do, let's see, as dexterity, if I can be in the air. It'll be your skills. Okay, So, skills. like, so uh, the nature... Acrobatics. Acrobatics. Arcana. Yeah. Okay. Um, so acrobatics is still dex. Yeah. Yeah. Is that just... Blaze doing this or we all Unless don't. other people are going with, you can help her. Um, but if you are not going with her or if she snuck out... It's then... just like, I know that she's left before, so I'm really curious. So it's up to you. Do you want to take people with you? No, I'm going to go alone. Okay. okay. Um, Jesse. Yeah. She sent you a text what Shamu's doing. That okay. Night, for reasons I don't want everyone else to hear. Okay. I am going to attempt a stealth check. Okay. Just to make sure that she doesn't think that I'm following her, first okay. off. Um, I, if, can I just say what I want to do with multiples? Uh, or just well, one? We're going to roll. Um, yeah, so roll your stealth check, and then you can decide what you do next. Okay. Just um, so you know, if you fail it, it she's not going to find you. It just It's a failure towards your skills challenge. Right, okay. So for stealth, I got an 18. Okay, that's a success. That's finally. Um... <laughs> And then, if I would use investigation, okay. I want to use that to my advantage to keep track of her. Okay. Okay. Ooh. Dang. Um, twenty-four. Oh, okay. That's a success. And then I'm I'm not gonna flap my wings because I would assume that we make a lot of noise. Mm-hmm. So then I am going to do um, let's see, would that be acrobatics or athletics? To, like Ath- just like run and kind of just follow her. Athletics. <laughs> okay. Um. That is a 14. Okay, that is a failure. Okay, so two successes and one failure. Uh-huh. Would insight work with this? Uh, you have to explain it to me. How would insight help you? Insight, just to see, like, if it's just, like, a casual thing or if she's hoping to kind of sneak around. And if, she, like, basically to see if she's hiding something or if she's just casually, fine, like, doing stuff. Would that count? It's borderline, but go ahead. That's not good. That's a 13. That is a fail. Okay. So and two and two. Yep. The only other thing I can think of is deception to just like, you know, along with the stealth. Could I do multiple? Uh, no, you can use each one once. Okay. So deception just to kind of, if she happens to find me or if anyone happens to see me, just to keep yourself casual. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. Well, that is a unnatural 20. Okay, that's a success. That's three. Uh Uh-huh. You need one more. Okay. Gosh, I'm running out of skills. (laughs) I want to say survival just in case it's... Survival's tracking. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Um, that's a 21. Success! Oh my gosh! Good job! So stressful! So stressful! (laughs) Okay. So... (laughs) So you, planning on. <laughs> <laughs> you follow Aveline uh, down the street as she heads towards the center of the city. Um, and she takes a very winding route. She ducks into Red District a bit and uh, crosses Red District into Green 
and then back into red as she she makes sure that she's not being followed. But with uh, with your successful checks, uh, you're able to fo- keep up with her and, and follow her and stay out of sight. Most importantly, uh, using that disguise, uh, passersby don't notice that you're following her, even if you're not the stealthiest in the world. Mm-hmm. Um, you know, actually, I think you succeeded the stealth check. I can't remember either way. Either way, um, you follow her to the very inside of the city, and she actually follows the um, the bluff around to the other side of this bluff, which takes some time. It's starting to get really late by the time you get to the bluff. And on the other side, uh, where the can- the most the outward canal meets the bluff, there is an entrance to the sewers. And there are a couple guards there, but because she's a cat, she just kind of slips behind them and goes in. However, because there's guards there, you are unable to follow her further. Yeah, I wouldn't do that, but that's interesting. Okay. Yeah. So, and once I see that, I just decide to go back. Okay. And then I think we're going to take a break there. When we come back, we will do our shopping and prepare for the next adventure. Yay! Yay! Yay!